Hello, this is Pamela. Welcome to my channel. Grab you a cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and enjoy some good old yarny talk. Hello, this is Pamela, and you're on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. Welcome to my channel, and I'd like to say Happy Memorial Day to everyone out there. Um, today is Monday, and it is Monday Crochet Chat. So what I have today is I'm basically going to be showing off where I'm at on the uh, crochet long. But um, I do have this right here that I was going to show you guys. Um, I have an update on the Annie's Casablanca kit that I ha get once a month. I was, I'm was i going to show an update on this. It's already filmed and ready to go. And I will be releasing this Thursday. So be sure and look for the video on this. <laughs> um, the update on it. And I'm pretty excited to show you guys all my squares and all that. It's a little bit too long to show in this video. So I just made a video um, all about it all by itself. <laughs> the other thing that I do have to show you guys today is my Annie's kit that I get once a month on. Um, it is the Love to Crochet kit. Well, this right here is a... Uh, a throw, let's see, lovely, lovely lapgan is what it's called. Lovely lapgan. And here is, I'll show you this one. Here's the yarn that they gave me. It's a little tough to work with, I'm not going to lie. But um, once you get past the chain, then it's a lot easier. But I did have to take my ring off because it kept wanting to snag and pull on my ring. So, um, otherwise, it's going pretty smooth. I'll show you where I'm at. Okay, this is what I have so far. And it is really soft. So, that's it. Ah, there we go. That's what I have so far. There. <laughs> Trying to get it all in here. But I think it's a pretty good size. I don't know how long it's going to be. But as far as width, it's a pretty good width. So um, I am excited about this one, getting it done uh, from my Annie's kit. And I can reuse the pattern for other stuff if I want. It's just a three row repeat. So it's very, very simple. You don't even have to think. You don't even have to count. <laughs> the hook that I'm using with this is a M slash N 9.0 millimeter crochet hook. And it's the first time I got to use this hook. So I was pretty excited about it because look at that bright, bold color. <laughs> so it's kind of cool getting to work with this. All right. So now it's time to get in on where I'm at on the uh, squares. I have three of these stars right here. On this blanket, I'm using a 5.0 millimeter crochet hook. I have one square, and here's where I'm at on the blanket itself. I have three rows. Okay, isn't it just coming out beautiful? I'm so, so, so very much proud of this. And um, yep, so I'm on row three. Um, I did put out a video yesterday on how to join your squares, just in case, you know, you you're at that point because I do have some viewers that are already at that point and they want to join theirs. How I'm doing mine is I'm making five stars and then I'm making five squares and then I'm joining the five squares and then I'm joining the five squares to the blanket. And so, um, yeah, that's how I'm going about mine. <laughs> um, I do. Oh yes, I do have a tip. This is from John and Sue. She uh, commented or left a message on Facebook group page. Um, well, we were actually just kind of talking some of us back and forth um, about the blanket and stuff. Well, she left a tip on there of what she does with her stars. So let me show you this little video clip real quick. So thank you, John Sue. Okay, so like I said, this tip is from John and Sue and she said this on Facebook and I thought it was a great idea. So you leave your strand of yarn that's on your star, your beginning strand, and you leave your beginning strand from your square. And so you just take your yarn needle, I mean, you just take your hook and go through this circle right here of the beginning of your uh, square there and grab that star strand 
pull it through like that turn it to the back side and then you just tie your beginning strand of your square and your beginning strand of the star just tie them in a knot now you can cut this strand off or you can weave it in but it makes your star stay on there better so when you get ready to take this strand to weave it in on the square it just helps it stay on the square better and i really like that tip and i have found it very very helpful so thank you so much john and sue um, I appreciate that, and I'm sure that all my viewers are going to that are making this crochet along, along are going to appreciate that tip as well. So thank you. So wasn't that cool? Um, I tried it. I called my sister last night. It was so funny because I guess it was around eight o'clock. Um, I called her and I said, "Hey, you know, we, well, we were just talking," and um, I said, "What well, during our talking?" Of course, it always went back to this, and. She's telling me how many star, uh, squares and stuff that she's got done. And I said, hey, I have a tip for you. And so I told her what John Sue had said. And um, she said, and it wasn't even 10 minutes ago that she had just weaved in the yarn for her star. And, um, you know, so now she's going to would have to do another star and, you know, and all this stuff. And so um, I guess while we were talking, she took, I guess, t took her strand out. <laughs> <laughs> that she had weaved in there and then uh she tried it and she said oh man that works perfect so john sue that really was a great idea i used it on my last five st uh, squares that i did and it really kept the star from moving around on me it was it is perfect tanya loved it i love it and so i just had to share that with all of you guys so that was a really a great tip. So yeah, go and watch that video if you want of um, how to join squares. And I'm going to, I guess, spend the rest of my time working on making more of these squares and try to get my finish. Oh, yes, I do have something. There are a few of you that have updated your square, your blanket in the Facebook group page. And so I want to share that with you. Um, just, a, I don't know, there may be four people so far. Um, some of you have been posting your square and stuff like that, but some of you have posted, you know, like how many square, how many rows you actually have done. So let me share that with you guys because I just think that was so cool. Okay. Um, aren't they pretty? They're just beautiful. I just love them. Um, let's go ahead and do our 365 days of prayer. Unconditional acceptance. All that the Father gives me will come to me, and the one who comes to me I will certainly not cast out. John six thirty seven. Merciful Father, you are so good in the way that you accept me with open arms. You did not have to, but you chose to. I cannot begin to thank you for your mercy that takes me in just as I am time and time again. I never have to dress myself up or convince you that I'm worthy of your attention or love. You are the one teaching me how valuable I am. You've known it all along. How could I describe the depths of the gratitude I feel? You never cast out your children. When I think of the story of the prodigal son and how he squandered his inheritance and the joy the father expressed at his return home, I am overcome by the thought of such a parent. Your goodness goes far beyond my comprehension, and yet here I am living in it. Thank you for your complete and unconditional acceptance of who I am. You make me comfortable in my own skin. I love you so much. It says, do you believe that every part of you is fully accepted by God? Yes, I do. That was just beautiful today. Oh, and let's see. Tomorrow, I do have a video coming out of some shoes that I have received from Vivea, a company. And I'm so excited over those shoes. And so I'm going to do a little unboxing review on those. Um, that video is all ready and I will be posting it tomorrow at 8 o'clock a.m. <laughs> so uh, take a look at that. That's all that I have, guys. Uh, just enjoy today with your family, your friends, and um, live life, have fun. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.